Let's do this. Let's do it, let's do it. I'm gonna try and pound one suitcase. Where am I gonna put heels? Where am I gonna put boots? Where am I gonna put trainers? I don't know, but it's like the most embarrassing thing in the whole world. I'm going on a flight to Barcelona and I'm wearing a Barcelona top. I'm so excited, holiday. <laughs> this woman was convinced that my dad was my boyfriend. Good morning, everyone. It is another day in my life. I am going to London. Well, I was meant to go to London today, but I'm actually going tomorrow now, long story short. Um, and after that, I pretty much have to, I have the weekend, but I pretty much have to go to, well, don't have to, but I'm going away on holiday. So today is actually gonna be like a big errands day. I thought I would film like a big pack with me. I've got to unpack my last suitcase. It's still down here. I swear half my life is literally packing and unpacking suitcases and I actually hate it like I genuinely hate it so much it really stresses me out and when it comes to packing I am the world's worst overpacker as you guys know I literally took like 60 kg to Ibiza don't even ask me how I don't know but the craziest thing is I use everything and I'm like how in one week can I actually use that much it actually is because I am like a hygiene freak like I love being clean I love having all of my nice smelly stuff I take like multiple perfumes I have about four wash bags so I really need to narrow this down this trip yeah I was gonna film a pack with me on TikTok but I thought Do you know what I'll actually go a bit more into depth on my vlog and actually show you guys everything I'm packing I got some bits from Zara and um, I went literally bright and early this morning and got some like basic bits so Zara by the way is actually banging at the moment and their jewelry is like 10 10 so I will show you some of the pieces I got from Zara so yeah I'm really excited I've got like quite a fair bit of new holiday clothes this is definitely going to be the last thing i spend my money on in a while because i just feel like the last month i spent so much money on like holiday clothes um but do you know what it is i just feel like every year my body changes so much that i never fit in the things that i wore the year before so i thought i would just treat myself got loads of nice new holiday clothes which is lovely i will bring my suitcase up and i will start packing yeah i'm gonna show you everything i'll pack by the way i don't think i told you or maybe i did my mum and dad are also going on this cruise all of me and my friends are going but also my parents are going but we're not like spending time with my parents but my parents also got invited on this cruise so they're going so like we're gonna fly with them but the cruise is literally like a mile long i'm not even joking it is freaking massive that i don't even think we'll really see them and obviously you get off the boat like every single day so yeah i mean honestly my parents don't want to see me more than i don't want to see them so yeah um, but anyways i'm going to get my suitcase and i'm gonna start packing so let's do this wait just quickly i'm gonna show you the bits that i got from zara i actually love the pieces that i got from zara in fact i'm gonna start with the jewelry right can we actually just take a minute for how Stunning. No, 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 no. Wait, look at these earrings. Oh my goodness. I am genuinely obsessed. I love them so much. They look like little seashells. They're so nice. Then I got these. I wasn't sure how much they were going to suit me, but Imogen wore them. She has these. And honestly, she looked unbelievable in them. So I thought, you know what? If my girl Imogen can pull them off, I'm going to absolutely try and pull them off. And then these, I think, are going to be the thing that I actually wear the most the entire trip. These gold, like, cuffs. I am obsessed with these. I love them so much. I think they're so cool. So I got all of my basics from Zara. So I literally just got, like, all of the basic sort of, like, crop tops, basically. Like, in every colour. I'm not even joking because I really needed to do a top-up of this. I feel like I always wear, like weird or cool jeans <laughs> weird jeans in my opinion of cool jeans and then i just throw on like a basic t-shirt that is literally my life look how cute this top is though that i got from zara it's actually the cutest thing i've ever seen in my life like look at the little arms and the bottom and then i always get my shirts from zara zara do such great shirts I can't even tell you. So I just got a oversized striped pink and white shirt. And then I also got it in blue. I basically do actually have this already in blue, but I did actually shrink it because I'm actually amazing at shrinking clothes in the washing. So if you ever need anything to go a bit smaller, just ask me, I'll sort you right out. Absolutely not out of choice, but I do just manage to shrink everything. So I had to buy myself a new one, but this shirt, I've been asked so many times where I've got it from. So it's Zara, they do the best. Let's do this. 
Let's do it, let's do it. I'm gonna try and pack one suitcase too because I can't be doing the whole two suitcases thing. I just can't, so. One wash bag, Saffron. Should I start in my wash bag? I don't even know. I, don't, I never know where to start. Yeah, I'm gonna start with gym clothes, wash bag. Why am I exhausted from walking up the stairs? And what else do I need? Yeah, all, all the boring stuff. Underwear, blah, 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 blah. Okay, bye. Okay, so I've started packing my one wash bag. Actually, that is a lie. I've got two, but technically, my other wash bag just has all of my contacts in. So, okay, give me the benefit of a doubt. Priority, I'm not even joking, is toothpicks. Like, I have to always take, not toothpicks, Pick, floss pick. I always have to take floss. Like this is the one that I take in my bag everywhere with me because I always get things caught in my teeth and like I can't get it out and it bugs me. So I take this everywhere with me. I was gonna pack my mouthwash, guys. I've resisted because I thought, you know what, it's too big, saffron. You can go a week without mouthwash. And then inside, I've just got like hair stuff. This is my Sephora headband that I use every day to get ready with, so I don't get makeup in my hair. I've got some face wipes. I've just literally packed some simple face wipes and then hair brushes. This is my favorite hair brush that I own. It's actually from DHD it's just like a paddle brush but it's amazing if you have hair extensions because it doesn't like actually brush your hair it like goes over the top if that makes sense so it's amazing for like sleeking your hair um so that's why I bring this and then also this is another one of my favorite brushes from Sway this is the complete opposite this gets out every single knot that you could ever imagine it's the best hairbrush so I packed both of these hairbrushes my got to be hairspray there is absolutely nothing better although I'm sure it's really not great for our hair because it literally freezes your hair I just don't think you will ever find a better hairspray. Goodness, I would have died. I nearly forgot deodorant and then also a perfume. I literally, oh, I love perfume so much. I think I'm gonna pack this one. This is like my holiday perfume. My mum got me this one from Penhaligon's for my birthday. And the only time I've actually wore this one is when I was in Ibiza. So it reminds me of like holiday and it smells a bit like holiday. So this is my perfume of choice. Okay guys, so I thought I would show you the pieces that I got from this little small business called Cloud18. Now I know there's also another brand which I actually got my gold bag from that I get so many questions about, which is from Olivia Sales. And they do loads of pieces like this as well. So definitely go and check out both of these if you're wanting to find jewelry like this. It's these little necklaces, starfish necklaces. I absolutely love. And then also they have them in gold. I absolutely love these earrings. I think they are so stunning. I cannot get enough. And then I got this like big gold old bangle as well if you couldn't tell i just i love jewelry so much i love like big jewelry like this but then also i love like my abbott lion collection that's like a little bit more elegant that you can wear with more like statement pieces but sometimes like when the outfit's just like really simple like if it's just denim shorts whatever like you know accessorizing it with this like big gold jewelry i think just looks amazing and yeah i got a silver one because i actually own a lot of clothes that have silver on it and i don't have too much silver jewelry apart from my abbott lion um like clover necklace aside from that i don't have like any silver pieces so yeah i thought i'd get like one big statement piece so yeah this is some new jewelry that i picked up sorry i'm like probably gonna be in a different outfit every single time that i vlog because i'm like getting changed trying stuff on whilst i'm also vlogging but these are my favorite running shorts in the entire world i've told you guys about these a thousand times on my instagram but they are amazing they're from gymshark and they just look so good obviously they have like an actual tight cycling short underneath but i just think they're super flattering like I love the elasticated waistband I'm taking these they actually have a running I think I told you guys they have a running track around the whole top floor of the cruise how insane is that like I'm so excited so you will find me running every morning on the top of the cruise I say that that depends if I'm not hungover but I should try so I'm bringing my running shorts you guys know I have a discount code that you guys can permanently use on Gymshark which is literally just SAF and um, for 10% off like Gymshark really don't do discounts so grab it whilst you can actually you can grab it whenever you want you can use discount for absolutely anything on site i did a huge um big gym shark order actually i feel like i'm just talking way too much in this vlog though but i just got like jogging bottoms and stuff to be honest which i'm not obviously taking on the cruise i haven't even had pajamas yet either oh oh my god also there is a pajama party on the boat and there's also a red party so i've got to pack something red i obviously wore that like red dress that makes me look like the dancing emoji on my birthday but i actually said to my mum that she can wear that me and my mum are literally the same size so i said that she can wear that so i need to find something red that i can wear for this red party look what i'm doing 
Oh, you're doing the same thing. I'm actually vlogging. You're actually in my vlog now. Well, you don't need to show yourself, but Jasmine's Jasmine's also packing. <laughs> well, I just don't understand how people pack light. Like, Jazz, I haven't even done my essentials yet, and I've nearly packed half the suitcase. I know, I'm thinking the same. I haven't started any of the toiletries. Yeah, well that, I think that's my problem is I always pack too many toiletries. Okay, so this is the House of CB dress. I mean, it's like, it looks like it's fitting so weird because it's still got all of this on. And I'm definitely going to have to alter it as the straps are too long. But it is stunning, like the colour. I actually have to get so much of my clothes altered. It's crazy because of my height. And also I feel like my boobs don't really fit my body. Like I can't really explain it. So I always have to get things adjusted. Oh my God, it looks so weird bro. Like there's a label coming out of here. But I do love it. It just needs a little bit of alteration so it fits me better but yeah so cute <laughs> good morning everyone and guess where i'm off to I don't know if it's like the most embarrassing thing in the whole world I'm going on a flight to Barcelona and I'm wearing a Barcelona top But I thought it looked so cute with my little shorts that I'm wearing right now And I have like a matching shirt to this so I thought you know what screw it So I'm not actually spending my whole week in Barcelona I'm actually going on a cruise with my friends There's so many of us going In my case though I'm not joking I don't know how on earth I've managed to do it up Obviously normally when you sit on a case it always shut This case was not shut in and the thing i'm slightly concerned about is i've taken the max amount of weight that you can like i paid for 30 kg and you physically cannot take any more that like you can't pay for anymore so i'm a little bit concerned but thing is i did just lift it up on the scales and it was exactly 30 kg hopefully fingers crossed my scales are all good it's all right it's all correct fine um but yeah the girls are gonna be here in a second jasmine and amy are coming to mine i'm so upset because um my friend well obviously you guys know libby libby was meant to be coming but unfortunately she's sick so well first of all obviously get well soon Libby that's the most important thing but it means that she's not coming on the trip now so it was supposed to be the four of us now it's the three of us but we're still gonna have an amazing time Anastasia and that's all coming so yeah it's gonna be so good I really don't know if I like this hairband I don't know if it suits me that alarm has been going off all morning and I know I set them but it's driving me absolutely nuts shut up to be fair that is probably my sign that I should get on I'm gonna make myself some breakfast before I go to the airport Actually, do I even have time? Oh, you know what? The girls might be outside. Let me have a look. <laughs> Jasmine just said, are you bringing a book? Yes. Guys, I'm bringing my manifestation book. It's my favorite book I've ever read. Haven't finished it yet. I am bringing that book. Right, okay, I need to actually, I need to go. I need to go, I need to put some shoes on. I'm just over here prioritizing the most important meal of the day, AKA breakfast, AKA my favorite thing on the whole world. I always weigh out my oats just cause I like being aware of how much I have because honestly, <laughs> this girl could just keep eating forever. So, and also the ratio of oats to protein powder is so good. So I have 45 grams of oats and then 30 grams of protein powder. I mean, you just kind of wing the milk, but but well, you can just tell I'm so I'm so tired. I've actually barely had any sleep. I was up talking to my friend last night and like you know, I just don't realise the time. Anyways, that was me. So oh and also my laptop does not fit in my case. So hoping that I get vlogs up, I need to take my laptop. I'm gonna ask the girls if I can take it in their case. But anyways, gonna have some breakfast and hopefully they should be here. We're going to Barcelona. <laughs> I keep thinking, where are we going? Because we're, going like, we're not really though, are we? We're going to a few places. To a few places but train. Jazz and Amy are here. Ooh, Bright and early in the morning. Time. It's cruise time. Um, just FaceTimed Anna. She's already on, on a flight. flight. We basically, we can't have any delays. We literally cannot. And it's fine because we haven't manifested it. I honestly, all I do is talk about manifestation. Someone say something bad, I'm like, don't you manifest that? <laughs> we were saying that but, yesterday, the baby shower, because they had two balloons. They had a girl balloon and a boy balloon. Right. And the girl balloon popped in the morning. <gasps> and then obviously it came up with, it's a boy. And we were like, you manifested that. Yeah, and you the did. And <laughs> way through the pregnancy, they've been calling it, um, <laughs> what's the name? Tyrone. Oh, it's they've manifested boy's that boy. <laughs> so they just Even though, I don't, the one thing the I don't think you should change in the summer is a, is a sex it's, change, but yeah. still. Thank you very much. I'm so excited! Holiday! <laughs> Look who we found! Bye exciting. guys! Exciting, Hello. exciting! That's Me and Mum both got the memo today of coming in our pyjamas. So I just wore the top the whole thing. <laughs> Actually, you look like you've got the bottoms on too. So. I just said to Dad, oh, that saffron's just come away. And I went, oh, I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you want to avoid? 
annoyed me that <laughs> much. <laughs> Everyone in my vlog would be like, why would you not want to see your parents? That's so mean. I just addressed the vlog that actually my parents are avoiding me the whole trip. So guys, the funniest thing, I need to now explain it to my vlog. The funniest thing just happened. This woman was convinced that my dad was my boyfriend. How? We look exactly the same, one. It must be because you're so short, I reckon. But they probably just well, thought they're like. I don't think so. I think it's because I look so young and good looking. Yeah, all right. <laughs> but it's so weird though. Like, I've just got no makeup on. I feel like I'm like 10 years old. Like, I don't look remotely old. Apparently, I do. It's weird. Like, people always think I'm so much older than I am, though. That I must be why. No, I look young. I think I look young. I'm fresh faced. I look really fresh faced because I, I look rough I, as well, but. How old do you think we look? Oh, shut up, look. You just want to know, you can boost his ego a little bit more, guys. No, but it was so funny. Like, she must have told us like five times, I thought that was your boyfriend. And then she went, wait, so is that your boyfriend? I was like, no, it's my dad. <laughs> um, and then dad thought he was hilarious by telling her that mum was his mum, and she's a nan. Um, anyways, but we are about to go through. I just bought Uno, actually. I bought two lots of Uno. So if you mum get bored as well, you can have a packet of Uno. I don't think we're going to get bored on the boat. Guys, there's so much to do. You can even do a bungee jump on the boat. Yeah. Like, how mad is that? Yeah, Dad, and there's speed dating. So if Mum drives speed you nuts, dating. you know what to do. Yeah, what's there's speed what's dating for all the single passengers. Yeah, you can. <laughs> on the app. No, it's actually crazy how much there is to they do. They do under 30s. <laughs> Shut up. I'm telling you that there ain't no other way. Pack your bags and then you will go away. I'm not gonna... We've got the goods. We all got a Joe's Club. I'm so excited. Anyone that knows me knows I'm obsessed with Joe and the Juice. So, perfect little plain breakfast, sandwich bright and early in the morning. That's not gonna 